Can you see me? Are these rhythm leggings? <laughs> so, one day I'm just minding my own business. So I open up my mail and I see Napoa Gym. And I was thinking to myself, excuse me, wait, what? I have bought from them in the past. They have really good dupes in regards to like other types of leggings and Catherine Mueller is how I heard of Napoleon and so through her videos I was introduced to this company and I've bought a lot of like their Gymshark dupe type of leggings and sports bras and I've always really liked their stuff. I Honestly, they've got good quality stuff. They wanted to send me some stuff to possibly review and I was just like, wait a minute, this can't be real. I was super excited. I responded back saying that I'd love to. Part of the reason why I'm super excited to do this is because they just want my honest and real feedback. They're not paying me to say any of this to you guys. They just want to gift me this stuff to review, to share with you. They sent over, hang on. Let's get into this because there's a whole thing of goodies to go through here. <laughs> So before we get any further into this video, I wanted to just send a huge thank you to Napoleon for sending all this stuff over for me to review. And honestly, that's because of you guys for watching my videos. I just appreciate it so, so much. I am just very grateful for it. So Napoleon, again, thank you so much. And thank you to you guys for watching my videos, for supporting me, and it just means the absolute world to me. So without further ado, let's get into this. Okay. Are these rhythm leggings? <laughs> these are the 28 inch rhythm leggings. So for all my tall people, these will more than likely be a full length legging on you. They are a full length legging on me. I am 5'10". And for reference, all the tops that I'm wearing in this video are a size small and all the bottoms are a medium. Now, I've never purchased their rhythm leggings before, but from what I've heard, a lot of people have been talking about the fabric has probably been upgraded. It feels really good in my opinion. I don't have anything to compare it to on the other rhythm leggings, but in my personal opinion right now, these feel fantastic. They have that soft feel like you would feel from a Lululemon Align. But in my own personal opinion, there is more compression running through the entirety of the legging. And I like that very much because I don't want my leggings to be slipping, falling down. They have a nice high, high waist. It comes pretty high above my belly button. The waistband is pretty compressive. The entire legging in itself has like a medium type of compression running through it, in my opinion. There's absolutely no front seam running through this legging, which I am so excited about. Thank goodness. And I'm pretty sure that these are gonna be a legging that I'm gonna reach for a lot. I just signed up with a personal trainer and I'm gonna be putting all of this stuff to the test. So make sure if you're not, follow me on Instagram because I'll be updating there on all this stuff that I'm about to be reviewing for you guys. I'm gonna pop in here the green pair. They're exactly the same. Moving on into our sports bra here. I think this is such a beautiful color. This is the Lucky Sports Bra in purple gray, and this is a size small. I have been loving the whole high neckline, long line type of sports bras that are coming out right now. It does come with removable cut pads, and I am not a fan of those, but if you are, they're in there. You get this band. So here's the bottom of the sports bra, right? So then you randomly just kind of get this band that runs through it right here, which it's not uncomfortable wearing. And I didn't notice it to be completely honest until I picked up this one. I think it's sewn into the inside of the sports bra here so it won't flip. We'll obviously be able to tell with time. And it doesn't feel uncomfortable whatsoever. If anything, it probably just helps it stay in place. I honestly believe it's sewn in right here. So there's your band. And then there's the... So it's not moving around. So it's not like a free flowing band, thankfully. Moving on into the back, you got like your really pretty racer back going on. And then you have these little mesh panelings in the back. So I think it just adds like a really nice detail and also just a little bit of breathability back there when you're working on your back with the nice little keyhole back there. So I think this is a really nice sports bra. I, uh, I'm a fan. I'm a big fan of the Lucky Sports Bra. Here 
here we are and this is the 25 inch rhythm legging in the brown color i freaking love this color this color is beautiful these are 25 inch they cut right above like my ankle bone there i gotta say they feel <laughs> Just like the 28 inch ones, just a little bit shorter, no front seam. Since they are a darker color, they um, have more compression running through the entire legging. And it just overall feels very, very comfortable. I really do enjoy these. I have nothing bad to say. I absolutely, this color is beautiful. And I'm probably going to have to go back and purchase the 28 inch. I really hope they come in a 28 inch in this brown color because this, this color is freaking so pretty. And for fall coming around the corner, this would look... Oh, I just, I love it. I feel like this color really screams fall and I am here for it. Moving on up here to the top, I have on the Fly Sports Bra in the light cayenne color. What I do really love about this sports bra is what they did with the racer back and how they have all these really pretty like dainty types of straps back there. Obviously this is not an adjustable sports bra. I don't think any of the bras they sent me are adjustable, but I do feel like they are true to size. This is a size small and I feel very comfortable in it. They have the removable cup pad. The band around underneath the bust does not feel uncomfortable or too tight. I feel, I feel like I'm, you know, held in. <laughs> I just, and I think this color is super pretty. Jumping around, didn't go anywhere. So it's itty bitty titty committee approved. All right, we're moving into a realm that I don't review. <laughs> this is gonna be the first time I ever do this on my channel. They sent me three pairs of shorts. I think they're called the burn short. Here they are. Listen, I don't do shorts and I don't do shorts because of a few years ago, I was, I had Lyme disease and I was in a wheelchair unable to walk. I had lost the ability to walk. And that was a really hard time of my life. And so ever since then, I have the type of luck where I am in the most urban city and there is not a uh, tall grass in sight. With my luck, there will be some type of concrete jungle tick bouncing around and it's gonna bounce on me and bite me and then I'm gonna get Lyme disease again, okay? That is just like one of my truest, biggest fears. But besides that, all right, let's just put that aside and I am going to put these shorts on, give them a good review. You know, we'll see. I'm just, I'm not the type to work out in shorts. I don't typically wear shorts. It's just because of just the fear that I have and I know it's something I have to get over. And maybe this will be the beginning of that or maybe it won't, but you know, we're just, we're gonna do this. So let's do it. All right guys, here we are in the burning shorts in dark green, six inch inseam and yeah they're super freaking cute very comfortable very soft they do have a pocket right there so i guess maybe you can stick a credit card in there if you'd like i probably won't do that but they are very lightweight very comfortable i think i said there's no front seam which is making them even more comfortable in that sense they have a more of a they're not very compressive i guess i could say and they're just very comfortable in the sense and here we are now in the i think these are the purple gray and yeah they fit just like the dark green not compressive or tight around the waist there maybe if i sized into a small they might be a little more compressive they feel comfortable around my quads i do have bigger thighs yep there's my booty and i just felt cute comfy felt good just like i did in the green ones oh yeah and i kind of danced around here and moved around um, to see if they would ride up here i am running in place yeah and they did. They did write up on me, which is why I typically don't like to wear shorts when I work out. I just don't like that kind of feeling. And in the last pair here, these are the light cayenne, size medium as well, just like the other two. Very comfortable, not very compressive whatsoever. Again, if I size into a small, possibly. There's my booty again. Just checking it out, looking at it. Yep, looks all right. Yeah, 
I, I find them very comfortable. I I think I get way too much in my head about it. And I actually do like these shorts a lot. Obviously, you can see I'm feeling myself here. <laughs> here we are. This is the Motion Sports Top. It's not a sports bra, but it does have a built-in bra in it. So I got them in the lilac gray, which is this one. And to me, this really does look like a blue, but you know, they're calling it lilac gray. And also in this really beautiful dark green color. It doesn't fit too tight down by the torso area. And I wouldn't say that this is going to be a high intensity type of sports top. If anything, low intensity. Just a basic little sports top with a built-in bra, which is really nice, removable cut pads. I appreciate the fact they added in this mesh lining where the cut pads go. And then on the inside here, you have like a really soft fabric that lays against your chest. So you're not gonna be bothered with this meshiness. I love both these tops. I think they're super cute, super simple, and a staple to have in the closet. So these are the Love Life Pocket Legging in a 28 inch inseam in a, it is a blue black size medium. I'm not like the biggest fan when it comes to pocket style leggings. I like my leggings to be just, you know, pocketless. But you know, sometimes those pockets come in handy. Like these can hold my big old cell phone in the pocket. They have a nice high waist going on, no front seam once again. If I could high five you in a Pogen, there it is. They are full length legging on me. I have to say like I highly, highly recommend any of the leggings that I have tried on. But everything's gonna be linked down below for you guys so you can shop it. Chef's kiss, damn. <laughs> They, I have to say, they nailed it with these joggers. So they sent them to me in the, so they said they sent them to me in the dark purple and the truffle green, but this is blue. And then obviously I'm wearing the purple ones right now. So I don't know if that's the right colors. Yeah, let me double check on the website. Okay, never mind. This is the truffle green and the purple ones I have on are the dark purple ones. These are like a jogger legging feel and I am not mad about it. They fit beautifully. I think they look great on the body. Um, I love that they have such deep pockets and then the pockets have like this lining. It's like a mesh, can you see me? Yeah, so the pocket lining is like a mesh type of lining which is really nice so it's not like this thick thing sitting on your leg, which is why I think it sits nicely on the thighs. If you got bigger thighs like I do, the waistband feels solid. They have a drawstring, so you can obviously adjust to your waist. You can make them tighter, you can make them looser. And these go all the way down to my ankles. And then you have, then you have like your nice little cuff here that sits nicely on the ankles. They have like a really soft feel to them as well. They have a cute little rounding on the booty on the back there to just give the booty a little bit more extra shape back there. These joggers are adorable. I mean, look, this color, I love it. So cute, great length, movable. Move with the body. Yeah, they're a winner. On to the last item. This is called the Lake Shirt, and this is in the hibiscus, I believe. Hibiscus red. And it's completely open in the back. So what I'm assuming, or at least the way that I would actually wear this, I would just probably tie it up. I would definitely wear it like this. You have like a little peak back there of your little sports bra. Man, this is really soft too, soft and bouncy. I also have it in this color, which is the purple gray color. So here's the purple. Let's tie it up. I think it looks so cute. I don't feel like I'm getting choked out with this top. I feel very comfortable, it's breathable. I don't feel like overly restricted here, even though I tied it up. Like this still feels nice and loose. If 
feel like that was probably like one of my longest try on hauls. I've never done a haul with that many pieces and that took me quite a while and I am starving now. I just wanted to give you my two cents on my most favorite pieces and then the pieces I could potentially just do without. So the joggers are probably like my favorite out of this entire haul. The Rhythm Leggings, a 28 inch inseam. I really do like the way that they just are a full length coverage type of leggings. And then obviously I think you guys know which one is my least favorite <laughs> are the shorts, but that's just, you know, that's not on the shorts being bad. The shorts are great. It's just, I'm more of a leggings jogger type of gal. Um, but who knows, maybe this could be the beginning of a beautiful relationship of me and shorts. A huge thank you to Napoleon for sending all this stuff over to me. I really do appreciate that. And they kindly gave me some discount codes for you guys to use. So I'll link those down below for you guys to use. And also I'm gonna link all the pieces that they sent to me so you guys can shop them. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm just so excited I was able to do it and put it out there for you guys. So if you guys haven't already, please smash that subscribe button and also hit that like button. It helps out my channel so, so much with the algorithm and everything like that. And don't forget to turn on your bell notifications so that you won't miss out on any other videos that I do upload. Also, if you guys have any other questions, obviously leave them down in the comment section or you can follow me on Instagram or you can send me a message over on Instagram. I love answering whatever questions you guys might have about certain things. And until next time, YouTube, I'll see you later.